これか化けるふりかけごはんさっきまでと見栄えがまるで違う一体どんな味がするのか Hello everyone Welcome back to another episode of Anime with Alvin, where this week we're going to be taking a look at the transforming Furikake Gohan from Food Wars. Now that I'm done playing with my fake egg, I'm going to get started on the jelly like stock that adds that transforming element to this dish. So, in a large stainless steel pot over medium high heat, I'm bringing 700 milliliters of water to a simmer, which can take quite a while. So, I'm going to play some slide by myself. Just kidding, I have friends. Anyways,、um, now that the water is simmering, I'm gonna add in 30 grams of bonito flakes. And if I start dancing, then the bonito flakes are gonna start dancing too. Ooh, I'm not weird, I promise. Anyways, this is gonna sit for 10 minutes while the flavors infuse. Okay, moving on. Heating some sesame oil to fry up these chicken wings, which still have the wing tips attached. And these are gonna get a nice, beautiful golden brown jacket. While those are frying, I'm straining the bonito broth into this cup. Is, is this a cup? I don't know what this is. Now that the wings are getting a nice sizzle and a nice color, I'm gonna flip each one until each side is golden brown and delicious. After these are brown, I'm gonna put them right into a pot where I'm also going to dump in the bonito juice. Yeah! And some soy sauce. Gonna take this thing out because I'm not sure if it does anything. Just like my college degree, I'm gonna add some sugar. Some sake that is also good enough to drink. How would I know? I don't know, but this is some midi. And some grated ginger. Ooh, that's a nice that's a nice shot. Thanks, Brad. Giving these a stir with some chopsticks until things start smelling delicious. And watch until all those flavors just end up in this. This is a bowl. This is not a cup. This is a bowl. And these chicken wings, they're so delicious. They've been braising in all this stuff, and I I'm eating all of these. Seven chicken wings later, I am now back to skim off the scum off the top of this broth. This is actually a trick my dad used to do when he was growing up. I mean, when I was growing up, he was not growing up anymore. He was growing fat. Sorry, Dad. The skimmed broth is now going into two molds. These are square, so they can be cut into cubes later. And I do not want to spill, so I am slowly waddling off screen. While the broth is chilling in the fridge, I decided to put on a shirt because I'm cold. But these are some heritage eggs with these beautiful, rich amber yolks. I'm adding some white sugar, whisking them with my chopsticks, because growing up in an Asian household, this is how you were taught to do it. These are going into a nonstick pan over medium high heat with no oil or fat, just whisking them vigorously until these little curds form. Look at these little dudes. This is a scallion. This is me cutting the scallion into very, very thin slices for the garnish later. This is the stock we've chilled earlier. And it's not going well over here. Well, at least I have jelly number two, right? I really hope this one comes out a little bit better. Oh, oh, oh no. Basically, I didn't reduce it enough. So, our wonderful kitchen producer, Kendall, told me that gelatin is thermo reversible. So, we reduced it further, chilled it, and we set it again. Eh, eh, it's all right. I'll take this one. It's not going to get me into the Elite 10, but hey, at least I'll be able to please the God Tongue with this one. And look, little jiggly chicken soup cubes. I'm gonna mix these with the eggs until they are nice and combined. And now for the moment of truth. Into a serving bowl, I'm spooning in some freshly steamed fluffy white rice and finally pouring over the egg and soup mixture right on top. Some of those sliced scallions we cut earlier to finish and watch it transform. And now I finally get to eat. You can really see that the soup absorbed into the rice and the egg, but how does it taste? Mmm, I like this. And I think the god tongue would too. It's sweet, it's salty, it's creamy, it's savory, it's comforting. I love everything about this.、Uh, I'm gonna go over there and finish this because I think my clothes are about to start exploding pretty soon, and well, that, that's a different kind of anime. Thank、you